Since I was recently at a meetup at the Lakeshore Learning corporate store, I thought I would show you a little bit of what I purchased. Hey, hey, you guys, it's Christina from the Purple Alphabet, and you probably already watched my recap of the meetup I held at the Lakeshore Learning Store in Carson, California. It's their corporate offices and it's their home store. We had people come and meet up, we gave away goodie bags, we did some crafts, and we did some shopping. And I did some shopping too. And so I thought I'd show you my little haul of things that I found in the store, plus a couple things that I found in the outlet. It's always fun picking stuff out at Lakeshore. This was super cute. It's called the Magnetic Simple Sentence Skewers. And just real briefly, I wanna show you that inside it has a whole set of cards here and these little skewers that go with them. And all of the words that go along with them are printed on pieces of fruit that go onto your skewer. So there's 60 pieces of fruit here with words on them and you use them to build these sentences. Now there's tons of ways that you can play with Lakeshore Learning products and this is just one way I'm gonna show you, but you would match up, this is I see the, and then you have a missing orange here and so you'd match up all of the words to that and then you'd fill in the matching orange so it'd look like this and then once you have built it out you can add on your own word so i could choose balloon and see their magnet so they stick right on there or maybe i want to try this one which is turtle i see the turtle and you can mix them up so there's a lot of different ways you can play with this plus you have all of these magnets you don't have to use the skewers you can use them on a magnetic board um, all that kind of fun stuff so lots of ways to play so you get a lot of stuff in here. I've kind of spread out all the different flip books to show you that there are three different levels and books within the same level. So I have the blue level here, green level and red level. So a total of 12 flip books all together. So I'm gonna just kind of push aside the harder level ones and show you the easier ones real quick. Then you get these little pouches here to store all of your letter tiles. So you got green letter tiles and red letter tiles for more complex words as you go up in levels and then you have your level one, which is what I'm gonna show you now, and they can fit right into those pot pouches when you're not using them. So if I was doing level one, book one, I'd flip it over, and then it tells you which letters you would need over here, so I could pull those letters aside for the entire book. Okay, so I pulled those letters aside and I just kind of matched the picture here, and I have all my letters to start. First picture, which is a cat, so you'd make it spell cat, and you can flip the picture to the next one, which is hat. So what do you need to do to make this word hat using one of these letters, an H. And so you see they're ridged on the side so you can just stack them right on top of each other. And this is hut. So now you have to change it to hut. And the words just build on one another. Isn't that cool? And this is hug. I like that this kind of uses uh, critical thinking skills and figuring out how to make that word using the letters that you have left in your letter bank and switching them over. And it's not always the same letter because sometimes flip books, you're just switch and word families, you're just switching the same letter. And this one is just finding the right one. And it's kind of fun to stack them too. And by the time you get to the end, you will have used all of your letters in your letter bank. And it gets harder and harder all the way up until you get to um, the level three and the 12 book. They're all three letter words, but then you have some tiles that also have blends on them. Like right here, here's a CH blend. If you guys have been watching my channel and you know anything about me, you know I love anything that has to do with the learning locks from Lakeshore Learning. This one's the um, blends and digraphs. Oh, so much fun. They have them on all different kinds of skill levels and counting and addition and numbers and phonics, but this one is just kind of a more advanced one. You get all of these locks in here plus a whole set of keys. And basically what you have to do is find the matching lock and key and in this case, they are um, advanced phonics. So here's the FL, and you'd have to find the correct blend. Obviously, this is not Flyter, so that won't work. It was the very last one I picked out of the whole entire box. But here's the matching one for Fly. And then on the back, there's an alternative one for Flag. And then to check your answer, you put the key inside. And if it unlocks like that, you have done the task. These are so cool so fun kids always love these 
Next is the Lakeshore Smart Pencil Phonics cards. Now these work in um, conjunction with the actual pencil, which I don't have here to show you, but I have done before in previous videos. But the pencil basically uses one of these adapter cartridges. Here's one here, and then the cards inside. This one is the phonics set for ages four and up. And in the side, you have a series of different level cards, but you use with the pen and the child can use it on its own. So we're a huge fan of these. We have several of the sets and um, I love that it's very quick and easy and my children can do it by themselves and it's guided by the little pen. Now I have to blame one of my subscribers that came to the meetup for this because they totally inspired this per uh, purchase. So these are little fidget gadgets that I thought looked really, really cool and you can make all kinds of different shapes with them and they come in different colors, very affordable at only $2.49. So I have one for each child. We have some reward um, games that we do and so this is gonna be one of those prizes for those rewards. But I was so inspired to purchase this so I was heavily influenced for a change to buy something. If you have any kind of kinetic sand, this is a must have because it's a new castle mold set and we have some kinetic sand, the set from Lakeshore actually. And this is just a new spun spin on it. There's several different pieces in here to make little turrets and to make all kinds of different things to add on to your sand castle. And it was pretty affordable at $6.99. And lastly, if you love do it dot markers, there are some scented ones. I had no idea there were scented ones. These are the ice cream dreams set. Ah, oh, doesn't that just smell, not smell, doesn't that just sound like it smells good? And there's very berry, cotton candy, peaches and cream, mint chip, bubble gum, and chocolate. And they had another set with the primary colors too, with your more traditional fruity smells, I believe. Um, so if you're into the do it dot marker, I thought this would be a cool kind of sensory do it dot marker experience. We have a set and they're probably about halfway done, but we don't have these colors and we want to try the smells. And I also owe you a giveaway winner from the meetup. So if you see your name here on the screen, you have won a $50 e-card to Lakeshore Learning. Congratulations. Make sure to check your email because you have 72 hours to respond to it to claim your prize. And if you didn't win today, not to worry. I'm always having giveaways on my channel. Just stay tuned for more. So that is my little haul from Lakeshore Learning. Let me know which one was your favorite. If you're new here, I'd love it if you would subscribe. I do educational activities for kids, ideas, and inspirations to learn through play. So hit that subscribe button to see more videos like this and give me a thumbs up to show your love.